Assalamu alaikum guys, my name is Amir Unza. So in last tutorial, I show you how we can work with the Firebase list adapter. In other words, how we can populate our data into a list view. So one of my subscribers asked me how we can work with the recycled view because the recycled view used to uh, when we got a large amount of data, let's say thousands of uh, items you need to use our uh, recycled view because it's a uh, concept here to recycle the views and it's not going to Gain, give uh, too much RAM of your mobile or something like you can say so let's start it how we can use a, a recycler view so let me refactor my list view to recycler view recycler view go to your own uh, main activity XML and just declare this recycler view so my recycler view okay you can see uh, we just refactor our ex uh, list view to our uh, recycle view now we, go, we are need to go to my main activity and find our recycle view i uh, already done this but uh, let me delete and show you how we can do this private recycle view recycle view and there we go now we need to find our recycler view by find view by id r sorry r dot id oh what the sorry for that my recycler view okay now no, we need to cost this recycler view the next step is uh, pretty simple we need to uh, on on uh, sorry my view holder class because it's a recycle view my view holder class is uh, potentially take a very large view and something like that what i'm going to say thus you just need to my view holder class yeah pretty simple okay let me this uh, give me some space and go to outside uh, outside of your uh, main uh, sorry on create and create your uh, my own my view holder your own view holder anything you, you can say that create this create it private search class my view holder let me spell this one holder okay and it's extend from recycler view dot view holder yeah and uh, let me make a constructor here okay now we need it to a uh, text view here private text view my text I'm going to use a one of wide Android text to, uh, uh, layout, so it's uh, very simple. If you want to more complex, you can create your own XML. So I'm going to use uh, one of wide by Android default R dot text uh, layout. Blah blah blah. So let me find uh, our text view from uh, Android. Find view by ID. Sorry, item view dot find view by ID now in right ID dot r dot layout dot no no sorry for that in right r dot id dot text one okay now we need to cost this okay the next step is uh, we if you remember that we work with the fire uh, sorry list adapter so obviously it's a recycle it should be a firebase recycle adapter something like that i will put the link in description uh, documentation but it's a old documentation i think so you can see here uh, this is an old documentation it's pretty com not complex uh, it's pretty ugly basically so new user will be a terrified what are the f what is that so i'm going to make simple as possible so we need to firebase recycle adapter so let's make it firebase recycle adapter as you can see firebase which is giving me suggestion firebase recycle adapter 
it's a generic take a generic parameter type first is your model and second is your maybe holder class i think uh, first it's, it's ask fara where did you go man yeah first is your uh, class model and second your holders so in our case the model is student uh, if you have a simple string you can pass a string if you have any other class you can pass it but in our case it's a student model so the second is my view holder the next step is we need to make a new firebase recycle adapter okay it's give us uh it's ask for a constructor it's our it's this constructor is a take a four parameters the first one is basically where are you man first is uh, your class model second your layout and third is your view holder and fourth is your reference i know i know it's pretty complex so i just say but let me code this simple so first is your model so i in this our case is a student dot class and second is your view holder class my view holder and mural dot class and i'm going to make a mistake now sorry for that i make a some mistake here second is basically your layout we are going to use a, a simple layout by provided by android android dot r dot layout dot simple list item okay and the third is basically your view holder class and fourth is simple your reference my ref all is done so now go to your own populate view method and find your text view uh, this text view basically this should be a public okay find this text view from populate and set text view to text so we are going to model the student class something like that yeah we need to find our text view my view holder not my view holder view holder this one view holder dot my text view dot set text in our case is a model dot get name all is done basically model this one you can change this variable to student or something like that i'm not going to change it okay let's test this one let me connect my mobile with my pc okay here we guys going to install nothing happened what's we done wrong yeah we uh, sorry guys we just forget to set layout manager to our cycle view so let's test uh, sorry let's uh, give a layout manager set layout manager and new linear layout manager this okay let's test this again okay I, apk is going to again install it now we should get that our data into our app or into our cycle view again we got no data okay i think we miss we missing with the layout i think so 
अब वो यस वी मेक अ सिंपल लेआउट बट इट्स नॉट वर्क विद आर साइकिल रूम मे बी आई जस्ट मेक दिस चेंज आर डॉट ले आउट डॉट टू लाइन्स आइटम ओ माई गाट गाइज डू यू सी दैट आई जस्ट फॉर गेट टू सेट अ डॉक्टर दिस इज अ फिटी डम मिस्टेक रिसाइकल व्यू डॉट सेट अ डॉक्टर अ डॉक्टर all you need to do one line up code now this time it should be a should be a should be a data in our app because we make a th this is our third try or fourth try big uh, i don't remember really maybe a third try it should be a data now if we go again going to install so what what we just done here we just set our adapter so make sure you set it up for first now you can see uh, we got our data so thanks guys for watching sorry for i make a very dumb mistake and we i waste your time uh, to finding the mistake but coding is all about uh, making a mistake and finding the error just coding is this is coding you make a mistake you find your error that's all so thanks for watching guys uh, subscribe my channel to let's stop dates and uh, if you have any question let me know and if you want to any additional request uh, sorry if you want any uh, if you want to any request yeah uh, and just leave a comments and i will make a video on this i will